Hi guys, it's Dan from the Tech Plague, and today I'm going to show you how to set up a Ventrilio server. Ventrilio is another voice communication software similar to TeamSpeak but much more lightweight. So the first thing you want to do is go to a download. If you don't have a client, you're going to want to grab that for your current operating system, but the useful tutorial is for setting up a Windows server. So you're going to want to download the Windows Server Executable. If you read through this really quickly, it just says if you're in Afghanistan, Cuba, Iran, Iraq, Libya, North Korea, you know, you can't run the server in those countries for whatever reason. So if you're not in one of those countries, feel free to download it and go through the setup. setup. It's all, you know, it's the same setup that you can see in pretty much all programs. And then it's going to install it. After you finish that, you won't see anything. You want to go to your start menu, all programs. Yes, I play Euro Truck Simulator. Deal with it. Go to Ventrilio Server, and you're going to see there's a bunch of things that you can open. If you right click and click open, you can open up the entire folder in the Explorer window. Obviously, this is a start menu, so they're all shortcuts, but you can just run through and edit these. So, something interesting is the Ventrilio Server to INI. This is what you can change the name of the server, passwords, etc., etc. So, we're just going to call this tutorial. Yeah, and we can set a password as 123. Having password we don't need because I'm not going to keep this open, just a tutorial. So after you've done that, just save and close it. <coughs> and then you can run the server executable. As you can see, that's already started. Since I've already run this previously, you will get a prompt for it to use your network if your firewall is set up like that. And then you've got to accept that if you want people from the outside. Don't forget canyouseeme.com to check if your ports are open. And if it still doesn't work, then there's something up with your router. I'm, I'm happy to offer support with that if you comment on the video. Then you want to open the Ventrilio client, go to servers, new server, you can call it local or whatever you want to call it. If you're hosting on a dedicated server, for example, you can call it that. But I'm going to type in 127.0.0.1 because it is hosted on my local machine. We haven't changed the ports, that's the same, but we did set a password, so I'm going to put 1t3 in there. We don't have any separate channels, just accept that, click connect. You can see we've connected now you can see it in the list if your ports are open you can give your friends your external IP by typing in what's my IP into Google or going to what's my IP to org giving them that IP address and provide you have changed the port that port and they can connect and you can all talk inside Ventrilio that's pretty much it uh, as far as I know the chat doesn't print a console so you can chat here uh, I know it goes to a log file but where that is I'm not quite sure Thanks for watching, I hope this video has helped you, if it did make sure to leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.